I'm in the construction business. I don't have product or distribution. But if anyone needed transportation, I could provide that. First of all, I just want to tell you that I think this is the best performance you have ever done in your film career. Am I wrong in saying that? Thank you so much. Um, well, I, I think it all depends on just context, but I, I know what you're saying and I appreciate that. And I, I, I felt that when I read the role. I, I, I read the script and thought, wow, the, what a, not only is it great material, not only based off a true story, but um, personally for me as an actor, like what, what a great role to sink my teeth into. And uh, you know, all the actors came on, very passionate about the project, so thank you. Not once did you punch a guy in this movie that's nor right. did you take off your shirt to show your muscles. And when I saw that, to me, I felt like there was something almost deliberate about you not showcasing what you've probably showcased in all your previous films. Was this something that was deliberate or was this something that was just organic? No, buddy, yeah, you're, you're spot on. It was uh, very deliberate. And you know, the, the truth is this, this guy, this real guy, um, not your everyday hero, uh, every day, but he, yet he's just, he's an everyday guy who, who in the face of adversity doesn't stand up and face this challenge and break through it and save the world. He crumbles and he's scared to death and he doesn't know what's going to happen or where to turn. So to be honest with you, I'm not the first guy who you would think of, oh, I know exactly who should play this role. It should be Dwayne Johnson, definitely. It's, it's, so I was very fortunate that it came to me. Very fortunate that Rick Waugh had the, the vision to see me in this because I read it and I said, Rick, I'm so moved by this story, but uh, you know, you feel I could play this? He goes, I feel you can crush this. And I right. appreciate that. So um, all the elements were there. I wanted to tackle it. You're working with Nadine Velasquez, Ben Brad in this movie, Latinos. Uh, and there looked there were a lot of Latinos behind the scenes as well. Tell me a little about working with Nadine and, and Ben Brad. Uh, working with Benjamin was fantastic. And big admirer of his work o over the years. Uh, you, you could see why he's been so successful over the years, by the way, too, not only in his performance in this movie, uh, but also he's got such an incredibly strong presence, a wonderful presence about him, very warm, very cool, very smart, articulate man. <clears throat> Love working with him. Nadine's very special. She's a very special actress beautiful, uh, very smart, very intelligent. I, I love Nadine, I adore that girl. You know, mo when, when people, when I say Dwayne Johnson, most people think action star, and they think that this next movie is all out, you know, like faster, all out action, <laughs> revenge, yeah. killing guys. Um, will people think that this movie is the traditional Dwayne Johnson, or are they in for a surprise? Well, I think that we're going to manage their expectations. I think that they're going to be um, they're going to be satisfied with the action that we deliver. I think they're going to be they're going to be moved and taken aback by the emotion that that is carrying the action. Now, so to your point, Jack, yes, I think they're going to be pleasantly surprised, and I think they're going to leave the uh, leave, leave the theater. Um, some may be crying, some may be emotional, but, but at the same time, all, everyone will be moved in touch at the notion of they would do anything to protect their family, because that's what it's all about. Well, congratulations, and I wish you the best in everything, and let's beat Cena, right? Thank you, and we will. <laughs> <laughs>